Sports director has been in Los Angeles with the team, and he has all the latest updates. Jason, what's going on there? Uh, good evening, Kayla. The Wildcats season did come to an end at the Staples Center behind me. More reaction now from Sean Miller as he talks about that three-pointer by LaQuinton Ross that was the game-winning shot for Ohio State. We had a game plan in place to, to switch, and it's easier said than done. He's out there with some other really skilled and good players. But Coach, Coach was telling us was to switch all screens, you know, switch all handoffs and ball screens. And, you know, aircraft came off, all the way but he didn't come off as tight as we thought he was. So I, I guess it was a little confusion, and uh, the ball got thrown back, and he was open, he, he had a good shot. It's not about the last shot of the game. Uh, it's about, you know, I think that second that second half run for them is what really set us, set us apart in the second half. So Arizona is going home. So are their fans who have followed the Wildcats to the Sweet 16. The Mark Lions tied to get the game, and then what? Well, you know what, it just didn't go our way, and uh, they made the big shot at the end. First five minutes of the second half. They recovered, though, and tied it up. They came back. Uh, they played a good game. Very proud of them. And that seems to be the thought of most Wildcat fans. It's not like they lost this game by 20 or blown out or played terribly. They lost a close game to a really good Ohio State team that is going to play Wichita State here behind me in the Staples Center on Saturday for a right to go to the Final Four. Reporting live in Los Angeles tonight, I'm Jason Barr, down on your side. Kayla, back to you.